if I go do something else because somebody else told me to do it and I'm wasting time. Now you're wasting my time. I don't like that. I'd rather waste my own time. I'm so sorry for this bad lighting, but hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Now this is not how I want to start this video. Like it is 4:45, and I just got done in my Chick Fil A, and I was not in a good mood because I had not eaten all day. I just left my hair appointment. I got my hair done. Well, as y'all can tell by the title, this is gonna be kind of like my first week of school for this new semester. It is and isn't at the same time. It's not the official first week, but starting tomorrow, we get early. It's when we get early access to the classes, and I have to stay early on. Well, I try to stay ahead of my assignments because like life just be so busy that i can get behind like in a blink of an eye but um right now i'm at hobby lobby I'm taking a speech class and i'm taking an art class um the speech class i need for my bachelor's degree for my major and the art class is just the extracurricular that i have to take for my associates so yeah i'm at hobby lobby and i was gonna go to target first because i need to get some stuff from target too but I decided that since I got Chick-fil-A and Hobby Lobby is right here, I could just come here because I know for a fact that I have what I need. I need, like, specific pencils and, like, um, sketchbook. I have a sketchbook at home, but it's not the one that it says in, like, the course materials, which I'm pretty sure doesn't really matter. But I really want to, like, you know, be to a T. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to go ahead and get. And then I'm going to get... And then I'm going to go to Target and pick up a few things from there. And then that's it. I don't feel like going nowhere else. My head hurts so bad. And it's so funny. My head did not start hurting until I got in the Chick-fil-A line. And the line was taking so long. Like, I'm like, the Chick-fil-A line never take the long. But, yeah, I'm just ready to get this over with and go home. Because it's already about to 5 o'clock. And y'all know it's still getting dark very early. Oh, look at the little golden baby. Oh, he's a cute puppy. But yeah, let me go get to it. No more waste time. Um, sorry about this lighting, but it is literally the next day. Um, yesterday, while I was in the Hobby Lobby, and I was waiting in the checkout line, I don't know their machines was down or something. He had to like enter in like by the number, and they only had like two people working. But anyways, I was in line, and I literally felt so sick to my stomach that I thought I was gonna pass out. Like that's how bad it was. Um. But after I finally, like, checked out and got in the car, I could not finish my shopping. I couldn't go to Target. I couldn't do anything. I just drove home. And on my way home, I literally, like, almost ripped my car, like, three times because I kept I kept dozing off. Like, I was so tired. And, like, I got home. Like, I was so tired, I didn't even take my keys out the car. My keys stayed in the car all night. But it's okay because my car was in the garage. But that's how tired I was. Like, I went in the house and I put my purse down. And I laid on the sofa with my blanket and I fell asleep for the rest of the night. That's why I slept that last night on the sofa because I could not, I didn't have energy to go upstairs. Like my stomach was hurting, my head was hurting, everything was just, it just wasn't, wasn't where it needed to be. But then I woke up at like 2 or 3 a.m. and my hip was hurting. Like I don't know if y'all know but I have a hip injury from a few years ago. And like it woke me up and my entire lip was like throbbing. I'm like, yeah, I really, like, can it get any worse? So I went upstairs, which I really didn't want to go upstairs, to take my medicine that I have for it. And I, eventually it, like, stopped, you know, it stopped hurting. And I was able to go back to sleep. But then I woke up again at, like, five something with a cramp. And, like, the cramp, when I say cramp, I'm not talking about, like, cramps. I'm talking about a leg cramp. And it was so bad I was crying. Like, I couldn't move. Like, it's so painful. So, I had to lay there basically crying until it, like, eased up and I could, like, stretch because that's how bad it was. And to make it even worse, my alarm was supposed to go off at, like, 6.30. So, now I felt like I did, I wasn't getting enough sleep. I did go back to sleep. I know that much. But I did wake up at, like, mm, I'm going to say, like, 7 something. But, yeah, that's how my morning went, y'all. I don't know what that was about. Um, part of it probably was just me being exhausted from stuff duty or whatever. But I slept. Like, I slept. Like, I didn't eat dinner. I didn't drink anything. I went straight to sleep. And that was it. But, yeah. So, other than that, the date. My dad has been pretty okay right now. It's like 4. 
It's 4 15. Um, I just got home from work. And like I said yesterday, I didn't get to like go to Target and stuff like I wanted to. So I'm going to do that today. I will have to go grocery shopping today. So I need to make sure I have that list too. So yeah, that's what we're about to do. I could have just went straight to Target from work at the one closer. But one, I don't really like going to that one. Two, I don't like going anywhere outside of like work with my uniform on. And I also just want to be comfortable. I also think I love my money, so... But yeah, y'all, that's what happened. I'm still going to show y'all, like, what I got from Hobby Lobby, too. Um, but yeah, we're about to go in here, about to change clothes, get some comfy clothes, and then go to Target. And then I'll show you what I got, and then later we're going to go grocery shopping, which I don't know if I'm going to take y'all along with me for that. But yeah, hopefully I have time to do, like, a quick little, not really study session tonight. It's going to be more just, like, I like to, like, write down all of my due dates for everything. Especially with me getting a new planner too. That's usually what I do on the first day. I just write down all of the due dates and then stuff like that. So I literally put on like the chillest outfit I could find. Just some gray sweatpants, my gray zip up, running t shirt. Like I ain't got time. I ain't trying to impress nobody. Got my keys, got my water, I'm about to go to Target. As y'all can see, it's dark now. I actually wasn't in there that long. It just gets dark fast. It's just 6 11. So I got everything I was looking for. But of course, I'll go over with y'all when I get home. But I'm about to go pick my husband up so we can go grocery shopping and knock this out. I'm excited to go just because we've never been together like in the afternoon to grocery shop. And I went for the first time in the afternoon like a couple of weeks ago and it was so peaceful. So hopefully it's like that again considering it's what Wednesday. So yeah, I didn't record too much in Target just because it was like, it's that rush hour where everybody's trying to get in and get out and get home after work. But it's no biggie. Y'all know I'm sure what I got. Yeah, my room is a freaking mess. Like I'm not even going to show y'all because it's so embarrassing. Because I've had the, like, it's only Wednesday and I've already had like a terrible week. Not terrible, but physically motivationally like it's just not there i love my new tripod downstairs so y'all like popped up on something but yeah like my mom is a mess because my life is a mess and vice versa so tmi but y'all my cycle came on last week and when i say i was in the house in the bed for the entire weekend and then had to turn around and do a 24 hour shift on monday like, I just haven't had time to just really, like, you know, recoup and get it together. So, I got clothes all over my floor right now. It's just, it's stuff everywhere. I'm not even going to show y'all. But, we're going to get together whenever. That's what I'm eating now. They're so good. Okay, so, I also want to let y'all know that's going to be a change of plans. We're not going grocery shopping tonight. Because the grocery store that we go to closes at 8. And it's already about to be... Seven and it takes us like 30 minutes to eat there. Well, give or take, depending on which way we go. So, since I have everything I need for dinner tonight, we're just gonna go tomorrow. So good. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the stuff that I got from Target and from Hobby Lobby yesterday. The first thing that I got was a new planner. I didn't necessarily need a new planner, but the one that I have, I got. I'm gonna say like October, so it wasn't, it doesn't start on January, it starts July 2024, 2023. So it goes from July 2023 to June 2024. So I will have to buy a new one anyway to go to the end of this year. So I decided to go ahead and get a new one anyway, just to like, you know, I don't know, I feel like I need a new one. I am gonna keep this one. I haven't decided what I wanna use the rest of it for. I think I'm either gonna use it for work or like rough draft, so like write down stuff and then when it's actually solidified, then put in another one. Or if I want it to be a content planner, I don't know yet. But I'm not gonna throw it away because that's waste. This is what it looks like. Let me turn this brightness down. Alright, this is what it looks like. Just like I like the when they have like this kind of like weather cover and then the striped. Real cute. And I showed y'all a few of the ones I picked up. This is the one I ended up getting because y'all know I love this color. Let me see if it'll focus. 
yeah y'all know i love this kind of like i don't really know the correct like this cornflower gray blue type of vibe and i also had like the light blue and the flowers which i think it's so pretty as y'all can see and then um it does have like the weatherproof type of thing and it's actually inside of it so even though you open it it's a whole nother page this page is also like weatherproof too slightly it's a and then it does come with a ruler which my other one didn't come with and also come with these stickers my other one came with stickers but they're different stickers that i'm probably still going to use for this one but they're super cute real simple um and then another thing that my other one didn't have is like this folder pocket thingy yeah it has like a little folder pocket right here and then i really like the fact that the little like months tabs are like gradient so like dark light and really like um other than that everything else is the same as my last one the next thing i got is just a regular college rule notebook this isn't the five subject one it's just the one subject i'm not i don't think i'm gonna need a notebook for my art class but I think I'm gonna need one for my other class I'm taking. And I, like I said, y'all know I have an iPad, but I don't like taking notes on my iPad for specific things. Like I'll take notes. Like when I first started college, I took notes on my iPad, but I didn't like it. Like I got the paper light screen, I got the fine point pencil tips, I got all of that, and I still just wasn't, it wasn't like what I wanted. Plus nothing is like paper and pencil. I'm a paper and pencil girl, like, even like nowadays in class any classes that i take paper and pencil i hate taking digital notes i don't know i just feel like i don't have control over that i don't know and even like growing up like i probably could show y'all pictures of me in like high school where i had the best notes in the class like i did the colorful notes the pictures the diagrams all this extra stuff because that's just how i enjoy taking notes so i am still very much like that and it's been a while since i bought a college room notebook like this like the spiral one i have been using like competition notebooks and also like i don't know like i don't know it's something about pen and paper that's just gonna i think this has to do with my handwriting because i love my handwriting i get confidence in my handwriting all the time and the ipad doesn't really reciprocate the same energy like i write something on paper and then I write on my ipad and it won't look the same i don't like that I do like using my iPad, however, when I know it's a type of subject that I have to refer to my notes a lot because it's easier to just, you know, type in what I'm looking for, you know, to go directly to it. I do know that when I was taking, I forgot what class I was taking, but I started taking notes on my laptop actually because it was easier to just like type it out. But I really want to do, you know, notebook because, I don't know, it's just, it makes me happy. I like to write. To go along with that, I got these Pilot Gel Pens. I This is the smallest pen they have. I prefer really small pens. This is a 0.38 millimeter. But I actually need to buy some more. But these are my absolute favorite pens. These are the Pilot, another Pilot pen, Juice Up 03. It's the, point, it's the 0 0.3 millimeter pen. And it's super tiny, like it's so tiny that you cannot write on your skin with it. If you try to, it hurts. <laughs> but these, so this is what, point zero point three and these zero point three eight. I cannot find anything smaller than zero point three eight in a like regular store. I don't know any art stores around here besides the regular like Michaels and stuff. I don't know if they have them. But these are Japanese pencils. Um, I ordered them off of Amazon. They come in a pack of ten. I think I only have like four now but i absolutely love these pens because i write small and like the way that i write it looks like it was like typed and i love that so yeah it's the pilot japan juice up 03 i love this pen i actually need to order some more because these are the only pens that i actually enjoy writing with like i be judging everybody pen oh yeah i got my eyebrows done i stopped and got my eyebrows done i i i had to i had to end it anyways I also picked up these highlighters. These are the erasable highlighters. And I have highlighters, y'all. But I don't have pastel highlighters. Okay? I don't have pastel highlighters. These are so cute. And I cannot wait to use them. And they're erasable. Like, 
guys these are gonna be super cute unrelated to school i got a paddle brush because i don't own a paddle brush and i know it's gonna help me when i wrap my hair because i did not wrap my hair y'all when i told y'all i came in i went to sleep i did put on my bonnet when i woke up uh i woke up once at like nine ish and i did put on my bonnet but other than that, yo, I was out like a light. I picked up me and my husband the Olipop. He's just a regular lemon lime person. I got cream soda. They don't sell these everywhere. And I'm trying to figure out why. Like, they're so good. And the last thing I got is for dinner tonight, if I cook it. Um, I just got some chicken broth and cream of chicken. Because I'm going to make baked chicken, yellow rice, and I'm thinking cornbread and like some green beans or something. So yeah, that's everything I got from Target. Now what I got from Hobby Lobby. Like I said, I still have to go back and get two more sketchbooks, but I didn't realize how big they were, like 18 by 24. I didn't realize how big that is. Okay, so I got this sketchbook. I finally need to figure out some small ones because this is a lot of paper. I don't think I'm gonna use all of this. But I have a sketchbook, but I don't know. I wanted a new one. <laughs> So this is just the sketch, regular, schmegler, regular sketch, but they have these in different sizes, but the class doesn't like specify the pressure is like it's a sketchbook, you're just going to sketch out whatever you're drawing. And I got this one because I feel like I like this size, like the landscape, but then I can also turn it this way and I feel like it's giving, you know, and it's giving, it's giving portrait. So that's the one I got. It was $13.99. Yeah, I forgot how expensive art supplies can be like i wish i talk about it okay um i got these graphite drawing pencils i have graphite pencils they're probably old but i don't know where they're at so these are the graphite drawing pencils they were just 199 came in a pack of two i should have got a pencil sharpener i didn't get a pencil sharpener i'm gonna have to get one and then these are the vine charcoal sticks i was so confused i was like vine what what is that? I don't know what that is. So I looked it up and it's basically like just a rod of charcoal. Anybody who knows me in like high school, not even just high school. Yeah, high school when I first started high school and I did art. Charcoal is my favorite media. Like I ate down on the charcoal. I ate down on the charcoal portraits every time. Especially like mixed media. So like charcoal and like pastels. That was really cool. And then I grab an eraser. This is just the white vinyl eraser, real basic. The best eraser that I had. And then I got the kneaded erasers. If you're not like um, into art and don't know what I'm talking about. So these are kneaded erasers. Think of it like, think of it like Play-Doh. It's Play-Doh, but it erases. And then the more you like play with it, it like gets rid of the pencil stuff that's in it so yeah that's everything i got from the food lobby yeah as y'all can see i didn't make this much like when i was in there i really thought i was about to pass out because my head was hurting so bad and i felt sick but yeah right now i'm about to do what i said i was going to do as far as just getting well first of all i'm gonna clean my room i'm like i should clean my room let's say that i should clean my room and then i'm gonna Go through, see if I have access to class yet, and start putting in my to-do dates. I might. Anyways, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good morning. Um, it's 9.17 right now, and I should be, like, at work already. But what was supposed to happen today is not happening today. So, um, I don't want to go. Unless they call me and ask me, like, to do something or they need me to do something i'm not going because i just feel like i have other stuff that i need to do and i don't want to go to just be like sitting around that's just me i really hate wasting time on like someone else account but that makes sense so basically like if i'm at home i'm not doing nothing i can't waste my own time but if i go do something else because somebody else told me to do it and a waste of time. Now you're wasting my time. I don't like that. I'd rather waste my own time. But yeah, so today I'm just gonna try to get back on track, I guess. Cause like I told y'all yesterday, I'm kinda like my life's kind of a best right now. Not like metaphorically speaking, but physically, like 
my room's still a mess. I didn't clean it last night. After I got done cooking, I was tired. And I just kind of chilled on the sofa until we got sleeping. Like, we were supposed to play the game too, but I literally came in here and they gave me the update. It. So I was updated and we literally went and lay down and ended up falling asleep. But it's cool. So the plan for today is to, of course, my hands are so ashy, but it's to, of course, like clean up stuff. And then, like I told y'all before about putting the due dates in my planner. And then I'm going to try to go ahead and get a head start. Um, I don't know if it's in this last video that I have yet to finish editing and upload, but I know I previously mentioned about my study sessions and how I like to do them live. Well, not like to do them live. I would want to do them live because I've only ever did one and I don't know. I don't know if I liked it. Like, I didn't mind it, but it was over, hour. it was like an hour long and I know people who do like two, three, four hour study sessions and I don't think I could do that, not because I can't do that, but because... I don't think I can be in a place that's quiet enough for that long. I don't know yet. I'm still figuring out. But I do want to try the live version just to, like, get rid of the editing aspect of it. I don't know. I got some research to do. But that won't be for a while, I don't think. Because I probably won't do it for these first few weeks. So. I'm excited to do that, though. But other than that, I do... I probably am going to go to like Hobby Lobby or something today to go ahead and get the other sketchbooks that I need. And then we're actually going to go grocery shop today. Hopefully if I don't have to like go on to work for something crazy. We're actually going to go grocery shopping today. I'm excited y'all. I love grocery shopping. Especially like. I don't know. I just love grocery shopping. I love food, so. <laughs> and other than that, like, that's pretty much all I have planned for today. Like, it doesn't sound like a lot, but watch I make it more complicated than what it is. Because that's just what I do, apparently. I keep saying I need to clean my room, but, like, if I'm being honest, my room isn't dirty. There's just a bunch of clothes on the floor and a bunch of trash on my desk. Like, that's literally it. And then, like, my notebooks and stuff that I just bought. But everything else is just either out of place or just, like, slightly out of place. Just need to be pushed back or something. This is why I want to get, like, a a basket, like, a clothes basket just for my uniforms. Because I try to keep my room clean throughout the week. But when I have a tough day, like, when I have, like, a tiring day where I just want to come home and go to bed, I take my uniform off and either throw it on my floor or throw my chair. I'm literally sitting on clothes right now. It's so bad. But... I'm trying to get better, I swear. Anyways, I'm so hungry right now. I don't know what was going on with me last night. Like, when I cooked dinner last night and we ate, I only ate a little bit. Which, I knew I was going to eat only a little. So, I only put a little on my plate. But, like, I don't know. At first, I didn't have an appetite at all. But then, when I started eating that chicken, I was like, this chicken good. I snapped with that. I burnt my hand like three different times last night because I put the pan that I cooked the chicken in. I also used the same pan to like bake it. So I put it in the oven. So when I took it out, I took it out with the oven mitt because of course common sense, right? But after that, when I took the top off and got the spoon, I grabbed it with my hand. I'm like, why did I do that? And then I turned around and grabbed the lid for the pot with my other hand. I'm like, why do I keep doing that? And like my mom was on the phone. She was like, what's wrong? I, was like, I keep grabbing the pot. With my hand is hot. And y'all, I did that three different times. I'm like, yeah, I'm just about to get out of the kitchen. That's how you know I'm tired. Because why do I keep doing the same thing and expecting different results? Like, no. Something's wrong. Um, Luckily, it's nothing crazy. Like, you can't even tell. But, like, this whole hand was hurting. And then, like, these fingers were hurting. But right now, my thumb just itches right here. Luckily, nothing crazy, though. I'm thinking about how I should get my hair next. I know I wrote down how I wanted it. I was going to get some more um, spring twists, but I don't know if that's what I want. I might just end up getting regular knotless braids again. So, mm -hmm. Anyways, let's go eat. I don't know what I'm going to eat though. 
let's go find out. because of the mini concert I was having but um I am so tired I'm about to take a nap I'm not gonna lie it's just 12 54 though um hopefully I can just chill for the rest of the day and then we're gonna go grocery shopping later and yeah today's just gonna be pretty chill I hope I did clean my room and um everything's kind of organized now but yeah, that's pretty much it for right now. I still think I'm gonna try to go to the Hobby Lobby today. If not today, definitely tomorrow. But yeah, that's it. Um, I got all my due dates down and highlighted. Surprisingly, it's not as much. Hold on. Don't Surprisingly, it's not as much as it usually is, but I feel like it's not as much, but each assignment is more, if that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah. I'm about to just go in my room and kind of just hang out, probably take a nap, and I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, hey, I want to show y'all. We just got back from the grocery store. I didn't do a haul because I didn't really get much that's like interesting. The only thing I got that I really want to show y'all is two things. These, well, first I got the ingredients for this like trail mix that I've been seeing on TikTok. Um, it's like the Berry Berry Cheerios with like the baby food. It's the Berry Berry Cheerios, the yogurt melts, and like the soft like crackers, kind of like um. But it's kind of like the cereal, like the chip, like the Lucky Charm cereal, not the marshmallow, like the other part. And then freeze dry strawberries, but they were out of freeze dry strawberries, so I'm just gonna get some probably tomorrow. But I don't know when I'm gonna make it yet, so I guess we'll see. I want to make it on TikTok, but I don't know when I'm gonna get the strawberries. Anyways, I did get me some of these naked juices the minis um i used to love these when i was in like high school and stuff specifically the blue machine one but this is a variety pack a variety 12 pack i'm gonna put some in my little refrigerator right here hopefully they fit but i was excited to see these some people say like they're not that good but i mean they taste good so i got my dinner i'm really not that hungry so it looks like a little but i got some Yellow rice with baked chicken that I made, like creamy baked chicken with onions and bell peppers. And then green beans. I know it's not a lot. And then some rolls, which just looks like a lot. But y'all, yeah, I'm gonna slap for bread, okay? I eat bread for breakfast and for dinner. That's my downfall. That's one of the reasons it's hard for me to lose weight. I freaking love bread. But yeah, so that's my dinner. But like I said, I'm really not that hungry. That's why it's not a lot. And I also got my Olipop. This is the orange squeeze i haven't tried this one before it says our orange squeeze bring events orange soda with a citrus vitamin c rich blend of natural ingredients clementine and mandarin juices collide with a hint of lemon to produce a bright twist on the nostalgic classic so we're about to see if it tastes like i think i heard someone say it tastes like orange cream like the ice cream and that's good Good. It just tastes like orange soda. I personally am not a big fan of carbonated drinks. Like, that's one of the reasons I stopped drinking soda. I stopped drinking soda, like, when I was in high school. And for years, I didn't drink, like, soda unless it was, like, I felt like I had to because, like, that was the only thing available. But it was very rare. I would just drink water. But I don't like heavily carbonated beverages. So, like, 
sparkling water. I'm not a big fan of sparkling water. I'm not a big fan of Sprite. I like the way Sprite tastes, but I don't like carbonated beverages. So I would drink a flat drink any day, but carbonated beverages, I'm not really big on because I just don't like the way, but the way it makes me feel. I just don't like it. I feel like I'm drinking static, <laughs> but this isn't overly carbonated, so it's not that bad. I know when something is overly carbonated, when I drink it, it gives me hiccups. That's one of the reasons I don't like McDonald's Sprite because anytime I drink it, that first sip always, always, always gives me hiccups and it's so annoying. But yeah, I'm about to eat dinner, play the game a little bit, and I don't know, I'll talk to y'all either tonight or tomorrow because I have to get up in the morning because we have a mission at 6. I might actually go to the gym tomorrow. I usually don't just because of like the way the times are set up, but I don't know. We'll see what time I go to sleep because it's already about to be 8, so we'll see. Cheers. Saturday and I didn't do anything yesterday and then I've been pretty chill all day today it is 6.02 and we're about to go to an ice show um, I just want to show y'all my outfit though so I just have on my who are you bear California 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 sweater and then I have on my cargo was from I think Aeropostale. They're like white leg. And then I'm gonna be wearing my new shoes that I got for Christmas with my bubble coat. So I really I seen it like literally a couple of hours ago. I was like, oh my god, that'd be fun because we didn't have anything to do today. And like this, it was so pretty today, but we since we didn't have anything to do, we couldn't really enjoy it. So I was like, you know, let's just go out i guess but we also have to go to walmart after so it's kind of like you know it works out in the end but yeah that's what i'm about to do like i said nothing really crazy happened today i did do a bit of studying for one of my classes but nothing like as not as much as i would have liked but tomorrow is like it's no game tomorrow tomorrow we're getting stuff done so <laughs>